Hello everybody, welcome to the CCL final. It's an all French final. We don't know if any of the fans have been tear gas before it started or if there's been any fake tickets sold, but uh, I'm here and so is Fimir and Kalon. Hello. Hello. Oh. <laughs> here we are, bringing out the croissants, Le Mont Blanc, and all that because this is it. The high elves in the final trying to get the unforlorn time and the anger humans that have more or less destroyed every single person. Yes. <laughs> uh, Ungern's humans have been consistently banging everybody out as they went through. Uh, and uh, hopefully that's not going to be the case today and we're going to have a fantastic game of bubble. I'm just watching the two bribes of Ungern. <laughs> yeah, he's in just two you know? bribes. Not even a wizard. <laughs> not not even a wizard. What a mad lad. What an absolute mad lad. I mean, but that's the thing, right? Wizard isn't as good against, uh, against elves. Yeah, against so. uh, higher agility teams, the wizard yeah. is not as good. You, you have been saying this all the way through Chalice and proven right here in the fact that he has decided to go instead for the two bribes. Uh, banger, uh, yeah, banger, banger central. Uh, what has he got? Has he got two? He's got one dirty player only. Yeah, yeah, maybe he should have gone well, for a, a Merc. Maybe he couldn't afford it. Only, I remember yeah. when Unger only had one mighty blow. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's, a, it's a good point to make. Yep. Yeah. So, it's an interesting match, isn't it? There's, there's a, some really good players on the high elf team. Loads of guard. Mm -hmm. Four mm. guard, is there? Three or four guard. A mighty blow guy. The adj up um, catcher. Yes. So there's some there's some good players. Um, Ungern has smashed everybody he's played to pieces so far. He's got lots of tackle, some mighty blow. He does, yeah. Player. Four four tackle on this team, including one on that frenzy sidestep um, strength three catcher, yeah. who's been a uh, some utility piece. Yeah, he's been uh, actually great that catcher. Yeah. yeah, he has. And here we go in with the immediate foul as well. Yeah, just trying to get the ball rolling. Yeah, it's just a shitty line elf. Yeah, but couldn't get him with this. Only has one uh, bench. Yes. Oh, wow. And uh, well, there we go. I mean, he's doing the banging at the moment, right? Yeah, instant, instant bang. Uh, there was uh, so Le Marseille's did lose as well a strength four uh, catcher in his game against Chunter quite early on, and had the foresight not to apo it at all. Uh, it was a dead, so not guaranteed getting it back and. Did want to save the apple for some of his other more useful players, uh, but that is a lad to have. Uh, that would have been very nice against humans. Yeah. Oh my God. He's just oh, killed oh, the guy. Oh, oh. <laughs> wow. Okay. Have they swapped dice? <laughs> have they swapped? You know, it's uh, such a hit that your stream. Uh, ah, he came back. Yeah. He came back. <laughs> yeah. Your, your stream in Discord. He's dead. Yeah. Your stream in Discord keeps cutting out on us, and uh, it was just right in the middle of it going. You're oh dead. my God! This isn't Jesus. a glitch in the stream. He has just made another cas. <laughs> wow. You said the apple. Good apple, I'll say. Wow, High yeah. L's about to be unforlorn by the looks of it. Well, indeed, that's quite an amount of banging. And these guys are completely out of position now as well. I suppose they're not really because they are humans and can move around quite quickly. But, uh, yeah. Yeah, this is what I hate about that, about bribes, right? It's basically hoping that you'll be in a situation like that's good enough that you can make use of them. Yes. Which is asking for a lot in my experience. <laughs> uh, yeah, well, you you also have the, the old gym foul phenomenon with the double ones, right? <laughs> yeah, I mean, that isn't as bad as just, like, making the fouls, like, being in position to make the fouls, you know? Like, people will yes. people will induce them when they're playing, like, orcs with loads of guard, and it's like, dude, you're not going to knock anyone over to, to be yeah, able to Yeah, for foul sure. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's, uh, it is a really, really interesting part of certain people's games, though. I mean, like, fouling like Ducky, you know? Um... Like how he manages to work in the fouls that he gets is super fascinating. Uh, how it how it is like a you know one of the those it's an action every turn that he incorporates into his planned moves. Um, it's it's something I'm trying to work on, but I just I can't I, I can't I I can't always consider it. Um, but it's yeah it's 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 really cool. I wonder if he's going to yeah. foul back. Do you think he's going to foul the Pommer back? I mean, it's a pretty nice target. Has he got a shitty elf to throw on him? He does. He has an elf there at the back. Yeah. I'm right, just going to hit the line up. Makes okay. sense. It's the dirty player as well, isn't it? Yes. Defenseless. But he can do both things. Yes, exactly. He can, yeah, he can. <clears throat> 
you'd have rather blitz blitz this guy and like massive gang fouled him, wouldn't he? I, I, I think so. Yeah, I think so. And that that guy who we moved uh, there, the 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 rookie liner was the guy. Oh no, he's going to go for it with, with this fella. <laughs> yep. There was a bit of a plim plum poo in his pants there, I think, <laughs> when, uh, when that, that one came in. Wow, this is really up against it now, isn't he? Oh, well, there you go. Oh, well, well. there you yes. go. Just, just kill the guy back straight away. A life for a life. Yeah. Classic. Knife for a knife. Yes, it is. But well, Jesus, I mean, where are they both at? You're both at a bench, right? Yeah, yeah. There's a, there's a, there's a death on both sides permanently. Yes. So. Wow. Oh, yes. Ungern's apple, apple is gone. is massive. Yeah. No, he used it on this guy. Mm hmm. Well, I don't know about that. Uh, dog for the dog saying, um, dog for the dog saying that uh, it may stop the um, fouls, but I'm not, I'm not convinced. I think that's, uh, <laughs> that's still going to be a part of the game. <laughs> I, I wouldn't bet money on that. <laughs> yeah. This, this, yeah. this, and this, there this, we this, go. This, instant, this. <laughs> instant foul. Yeah. And he sent off. That oh. will end the fouls. Yeah. That will end the uh, fouls. We got, we got Kaz in studio. Uh, Kaz just reporting there that um, he wouldn't have done it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't have done it. Bad foul. Your ass! Your ass! What the what? But I don't hate it. He wasn't giving up a huge amount of position, and uh, ball is pretty safe anyway. Yep. And uh, yeah, <laughs> about to be less safe now. But sure, he's going straight back down again because he's piling on every time. Like, <laughs> even he if sure that would have been a useful square for him to be standing in, and doesn't even roll. Wow, we want to see a dodge GFI foul. Um, no, <laughs> no, no, it wasn't. It wasn't no. a good foul anyway. No, it wasn't. No, this is a little trickier. He's going to have to kind of break away, and that um, that utility catcher in the back is very annoying. And there is another mighty blow tackle in the middle as well. Uh, yeah, four tackle on this team. I suppose it's just because they're humans and they're able to get it, and they, you've got mighty blow. Why not take tackle? And yeah, uh, same with orcs, isn't it? Orcs often end up with yes. a lot of uh, blitzes with tackle. They do, don't they? Yeah. yeah. They do, do, don't they do? <laughs> <laughs> What was what was that for? It was, oh, it is. It's that's more Harry Enfield, isn't it? Yeah, probably. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's just gonna go up here, isn't he? And he's gonna go Hey, 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 hey! Right on fucking time, lad. <laughs> <laughs> <Hey. laughs> hey, cock. Uh, nice stream earlier today, cock. Really yeah, enjoyed it. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. That's nice, Hancock. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for staying fantastic. <laughs> Yay! Hello, Matt Skills. He came in just—he was fuming that you wouldn't even—you uh, wouldn't even play him. You're trying to um, <laughs> yeah, practice. I, tried, uh... I was trying to avoid him. Damn right. Mm -hmm. And then, and then I got like sixteen six zero necro. <laughs> yeah. Two hundred TV down. Not an easy match, but uh, had a glorious wizard. That wizard was pretty spectacular, yeah. Really, yes. really enjoyable. And you will be able to watch it in the YouTube channel of uh, Jimmy Fantastic. Mm -hmm. Keep an eye out for spray painters. Yeah. I'll spray paint your ass. <laughs> spray paint your ass. <laughs> okay, well, that's pretty nice, actually, being able to take out that central tackler is pretty great. Yeah, beautiful. Beautiful stone. It's definitely going to help for a lot for next turn because now all he actually has to worry about is that uh, super catcher. But su by, by super catcher, we mean he's strength three. So, you know, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he's it's not, not actually that. He's, he's like, not that super. Oh my God, but it's yeah, strength three. So he's... Yeah. He's super for a, for a human catcher. He's pretty phenomenal. Yeah. But, you know. He is, alas, just a human catcher. <laughs> Indeed. Pro probably one of the worst pieces that's to use as a catcher because, you know, <laughs> strength. Tackle, frenzy, yeah. typical uh, <laughs> skills you want in your catcher. Oh, obviously, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Is he the only catcher as well? Because I think the other yeah. one, the other ones I, died, I, or yes, I think all the others died. So, all your strongest. Would you like the strength on the catcher? Out of curiosity, Jim, I've always taken guard on a double six. 
Yeah, I quite like the strength because then then they're, they're like a crap werewolf, aren't they? <laughs> <laughs> what, why are you talking? Why people? What is this conversation happening so long, so many times about people rejecting plus strengths <laughs> and pieces? Yeah, well, it's the difference between strength two and strength three isn't really massive, and a guard catcher on a human team is just really, really useful for being able to redistribute your guard because they need guard. Mm. Same as a, a wood elf uh, catcher going from strength two to strength three on a wood elf catcher is not really a big deal. You have the Blitzer for guard, you have the Ogre for guard, you have the Linus with doubles with yep. guard. Yeah. The thing with the, the thing with Wood Elves is they've already got the dancers right, whereas mm -hmm. whereas if you give the strength to a catcher then you've got to move eight strength three, which is something you wouldn't have otherwise. So you take it on a Wood Elf catcher as well then? No, because you've already got dancers. You've already got right. eight strength Because you already have a move eight strength three, mm. yeah. Sure. So like so that, so that's the aspect with the human catcher, but yeah, with with the, with the woody woody catcher, you've already got dancers. So, hmm. Wait. I'll have to, here we go, back 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 on normal. <laughs> I'll I'll have to give it a try sometime. The next time I roll a double six on a human catcher, I will try the strength. Glorious. And just mm. think, you didn't need a pile on if you just tackled this uh, this guarder, sidestep, mm. cast him. Mm -hmm. I would have been tempted to just hit him with a mighty blow, and not blitz with a pom, but. The thing is, if you hit the if you hit the scumbags with a palm, then eventually you thin out the ranks and you get Indeed. the players anyway. I think that uh, I am a big supporter of the first turns of the game. Go for the cheaters. Yes. Yeah. Because reduce numbers, they're not gonna use the apple, so there is no chance. You oh. know, usually go. Just, just got the got the power anyway. Yeah. Powered my blood, ja. Thirty percent impossible. No, it's impossible. <laughs> Basically impossible. Can't believe it has happened. Oh, it doesn't kill him. Sad. Okay. I was wondering if what, why the pause, and then I realized, oh, we just caught up. Yes, yeah, yeah. we've actually caught yeah. up to the Yes, uh, if you were watching, uh, yeah, yeah. the first turns were just uh, replay turns because they started early. Mm -hmm. yep. Strange for the French, isn't it? <laughs> Normally you'd expect true, like a half true, an hour delay or something. But yeah, 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 yeah. some tear gas around, you know. The... <laughs> Oh, so I mostly watch the um, uh, only ever watch French when I'm uh, French TV when I'm watching the rugby and uh, the French uh, rugby whenever they're do, they're showing whatever the Six Nations games are they're top fourteen or something they're fucking hyped for slow mo cameras mm. uh, it's all like it, it's like nobody else does it the way they do but like it's all you know a slow mo of a guy hitting the line knocking other guys out of his way or somebody jumping up in the air in slow mo while. Mm. Everybody else would show you what's going on in the match or replays of it, but they're like, no, no, let's show you this guy in <laughs> slow mo. This guy in particular. Yep. Well, the French lads always. Yeah. Oh, look at this. All right. Man. Oh, now La Marseillaise is in a pickle. A uh, little bit. Yeah. It'd be great to have an old strength four catcher being able to run down the side here and bash that ladder out of the way would be pretty handy, but. I mean, he has the super blitzer to. Open the side or mm -hmm. uh, go for the tackler bomber. Oh, yo, yo, yo. Yeah. The thrower uh, not having um, like the guard would be lovely to be able to shove into that square, but he he just gets surfed mm. um, more than likely. So tricky. Hmm. So he going through the middle again then. So you're going to go have a hop off the uh, mighty blow lad. There you go. Just, yeah. He's just repositioning, I guess. Oh, he's going to go through the gate. The gate dodge, mm -hmm. is he? The gate dodge, yeah. Weak diagonal. The weak diagonal, as Dio would say, yeah. Yeah. Well, I prefer that. He can advance there. He can move there. He Indeed. can pass through there. He doesn't have enough movement. No, he's got the yes. long enough throw. What an idiot. <laughs> and, uh... <laughs> <laughs> not not the Marcelet the idiot. I mean the thrower is an idiot, like movement six. Yeah. I hate him. I absolutely hate a movement six ball carrier. It's terrible. In fact I think that the one that should be carrying the ball should be the line or you know if you're moving six the line or side the step because it's blocked side the step. Mm -hmm. And the and the thrower has guard. Mm -hmm. Which is yeah, you don't wanna need that. <laughs> yes. It's not terrible the ball carrier having guard though. Um it does mean that the lads can kinda of shove him away after. If somebody were to go in, but not taking advantage of that weak night, weak diagonal. <clears throat> as, P as PC hates calling it the gate as well because gates are, you know, open. Oh, 
Talk too fast, there's someone going through. Mm -hmm. Yes, for Fabrio, they, they made passing worse and increased the costs of throwers. Amazing. <laughs> Just amazing. Yeah, I was playing a game of Blood Bowl uh, tabletop the other day and uh, I had to do a... So it was turn eight and I was I was playing Dark Elves. Uh, it was turn eight and I needed to pick up the ball and throw a pass from one Witch Elf to another Witch Elf in the end zone. And uh, because it was four squares away, it was a six plus pass. Oof. Six plus, ladies and gentlemen, from a Witch Elf to another Witch Elf. Because that's how passing works in the new rules. Mm. I was it's not absolutely. impressed. Which, which Elf passed it? Yeah, the witch elf. Yeah, yeah. Good man. Well done. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Was the witch witch elf? The witch elf. Yeah. Who who's on first? Etc. Cetera, Etc. Cetera. The ball is not safe. Mm -hmm. It's not, is it? He has the catcher with a strength three that I think is in a easy range. Yep. And he shoves him onto um, uh, shoves him onto guard as well. So it is one into two. It's very interesting. I think you'll try and power this guy first. Mm -hmm. Yeah. If he gets the power there, that's a... Uh, I stray the line towards the ball. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He does get the power. Oh. Boy, howdy. Mm. He can clog it up at least with his, uh, with his corpse, provided he doesn't get removed. A bit, but he can hit the other one then, can't he? So this is the this yes. is problem as well. But the other one also has a... Okay, that's a good square to fall. Yeah. Yeah, that's the right. That's the right one. But I mean, he can just it, he can just directly blitz him. Like you know, this guy can assist. Can yeah. Now, now the catcher blitz. just comes straight into assist. Yeah. Oh. Oh no! He's gonna he's, he's gonna go with the catcher. With, uh, he's going with the catcher. I thought he was going yes. with the bomber. Um, I'm very surprised not to see him palming, but uh, I think this does is a better use of his resources. No, uh, also because the Pomber has a Juggernaut, so in case, you know, if he gets a block or something like that, or block or something like that, can he still push? Yeah, but the other, guy has, the other guy has Frenzy Tackle, so if he can get the ball on the ground, he's fine, and then he'll probably yeah. be the, guy, the right guy to pick it up as well after. He's got to do one in nine dodge, though, hasn't he, if he wants to utilize the Frenzy? Um, or, oh, because it's, it's a full nine, is it? Mm. Yeah, so he has to he go does through it. the... He yeah, does it. Yeah, he does, yeah. And he gets the power. Wow, first time. And he gets uh, the Kaz. Obviously, oh. obviously, that's it. Didn't need a blitz that's with Mighty Blow, he'll just get the Kaz anyway. He apples, yeah, he apples that straight away, yeah. <laughs> he has to avoid it yeah. now, and the ball goes. Classic okay. Ungern. Wowie. This is admin dice, yeah. <laughs> Literal admin dice. Mm -hmm. Not doesn't re-roll that. No, because he just wants to. He's going for the scatter. Oh, 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 oh that would have been cheeky. I would have enjoyed that. Hmm. So I guess you That's have to dodge here, at least. I could just foul. He could just foul. One assist foul. Yeah. Yeah, he's going to do it. It's yeah, happening. It's exactly, yeah. happening. There you go. Oh. Oh. oh, well, he's got the other bribe anyway, so it's fine. Yeah. But that's both of his bribes gone? No, or one of them? No, just no, one, just one. one. Okay. Oh, because it was Unger and got, or it was Lamar's got caught. Yeah, 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 Lamar's yeah. been sent on. Yeah. So of his three removals, one is self-removed. Also, both mm -hmm. apples are gone now. Yes. So... Playing for keeps. Yep. And uh, I know. the Kyles are capped at nine. Mm. Yes, Lamar says yes, interstand seven. What a turnaround. This looked like a, almost a sure win for the for the elves instantly and now somehow. Well yeah. pretty obviously how. <laughs> Ungern's killed everyone. Yeah, he just killed everything, yeah. Yes. I mean it, there is It's a four plus pickup, right? Because he has agility five. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, you've just got to go with him and then cover with him too. I, I don't think there's a real way of you being able to um to scatter, especially now with that guy being um uh, stand firm there. And yeah, this is, this, you can, no, you don't. The four plus can, is fine. He can dodge, you can blitz, and then you can three plus it even. Mm. Yeah, I mean, he has enough guard uh, to be able to do the reposition more or less. Uh, everybody mm -hmm. did. Yeah. 
Oh, that's interesting. I don't know, I think it had turned before then, but yeah, this... I, d I didn't like that foul before he did before he did the first one even, but I could see why he did it because at the end of the day that tackle pommel can remove your whole team, can't it? So, yes. so you do want to try and remove that high roll possibility. We don't know how big is the kill count of Ongar team because we don't uh, know numbers that high. Yeah, it's like mm -hmm. uh, Warhammer 40k, you know, Kane, <laughs> Kane the Betrayer to have the, you know, the, the, the yeah, the, the, the little betrayer. counter in the, in the <laughs> side of his side of his uh, visor. Millions or billions yep. already or something like that. That's Ongar. <laughs> I think you dodge the guard to there, you blitz him, one, two, mm -hmm. three, four, chain him away, five, six, oh my god. Oh no. Oh, yeah. that's the reroll. Yep. Yeah. I think you've got to do it this way though. Yes. And, oh my god, he's Oh dead. my god, he had, he, had like, he had loads of dodges from tackle, but I think he had to do it. Indeed. And, now and the KO is. as well. Jesus. Well... Ooh. I think it's going to be a uh, Unger uh, scoring. Mm -hmm. He's in a bit of a pickle now, La Marcelin. A bit of a pickle. Let's see our bit of a pickle emotes, everybody. <laughs> a bit of a pickle. Pfft. He'll yeah. definitely be puffing in chat. Yes. Yeah, fair dodge. I mean, I agree. The second one definitely was, was rowdy. The first... I thought it was acceptable because you might high roll even higher. Mm -hmm. Interestingly enough, uh, just looking at that uh, board state there, the end of turn foul that um, Ungern did put in because there was uh, three guard around that in addition to the one assist would have been a plus four in uh, the new rules. Ah, there you go. Another important thing to remember that uh, guard assists all the time, including on fouls. Yeah, very nice. Which is good, really, because guard needed a bit of a buff, I think. Oh, yeah. Yes, he was clearly one of the worst skills it, it in the was, game. It was, yeah. I, I don't know anybody who takes it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah well, clearly. You know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> don't know anyone who takes it seriously. <laughs> don't know anyone who it, plays it, properly who <laughs> takes it. Uh, it, is the, it is the final. We are all here with our semis watching the final, Vader, for the win. Yep. Uh, so, yep, it is the final. All French affair. So, fierce European. And we're delighted. Uh -huh. Maybe. Oui, oui, oui. Pim pom plus. Flambe de pomp. So at the moment, um, Ungern trying to find directions to the um, Louvre. Yeah. Où est le, or is it, où est le centre de Georges Pompidou? Mm. Which is uh, just across from the Louvre. And now Ungern running away towards Le Champs Elysees. There you go. You know, I've been in Paris once when I was 15 years old, so it's like I perfectly know the city. Yeah, obviously know it perfectly. Yeah, it is no, a really nice. City. It's a lovely city. It's really cool. Yeah. Yes, the problem is the people that lives in there, but the, other than that, yeah, it's a lovely city. Yeah, it, it it suffers from the same thing that every capital city suffers from, which is that everybody else from the country hates the people who live in the in the city, and uh, probably for, for good reason. Mm. Hello, Senna. <laughs> just to live in France with Tim. No, no, no. Yep. Tim is the expert. He's the expert. You've been to Paris, Jim? I no? have, yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, I lived there. <laughs> lived there for a couple did you of weeks. Did you actually live there for a couple of weeks? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, I've been I've been four or five times. I I did uh, I stayed in Versailles for about two weeks. Yeah, um, I've been to Versailles as well. Versailles is lovely. Yeah. Um, the Blizzard uh, Blizzard HQ, which is now based in Cork, used to be based in, um, yes, in Versailles. Yes, that's uh, true. Mm. That was where I nearly went mm. to do a test to become one of the translators, but because excellent. They told me that I have to pay, you know, the, play, the plane ticket and everything by myself. I say, okay. what the fuck are you talking about? Yeah, sure. <laughs> and the salary, I asked a friend that was living in France at the time and told me, look, it looks like three grand. It just looks like a lot in that part of the France. Forget about that. You're going to be yeah. sharing a flat with another seven guys. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. Most of the lads were living in shoeboxes. Um, yeah. Get these French guys to talk to cyanide French guys about the horrible Blood Bowl 3 that comes, yeah. Yeah. Well, they're apparently going to have different colour options, so that you can have them colour-coded by the skill tree. Hopefully they'll make that the default, yes. because that's the obvious one instead of a nonsensical one, but never mind. 
Be well, we'll see. Idea. Yeah, it'll be interesting to see how it goes and w whether or not... It, I don't think it's available in the beta, though. Um, but it'll be interesting to see what they do. And uh, it did seem like there was um, there were some positives uh, out of the overall little things that we've been getting over the last week. What do you mean it's not available in the beta? Then, then why announce it for the beta? <laughs> uh, they weren't announcing, announcing it for the beta. They were announcing it as a reply to, Jesus, these, these, these two pluses are going pretty poorly. Yeah. Um, doesn't get it. Um, no strip ball on this guy. One of the few skills he does not have. Yeah. Strip ball works against stand firm anyway, right? Provided you got the push. Yeah. 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 And then White fails to dodge away. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, fun fox. Yeah, you do. Yes, for uh, if you are watching this uh, game on YouTube, probably uh, next to this uh, game on the date release will be a very short video about uh, Jimmy playing Blue Pro 3. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. How short yep. depends. Yep. Maybe, maybe we the, finally the surprise, you know, the dream comes, so. will reach the promised land, but. Oh, really? Well, uh, I'm very yeah. sceptic. <laughs> It's like meeting your um, your mom's new boyfriend, you know. Just go in with low expectations. I don't know. My mom has always been married to my dad for fifty years. Okay. <laughs> that's, that's, yeah. Okay. Well. Well. Thanks for showing off your uh, functional <laughs> nuclear family. <laughs> oh my God! There's a class. Yeah. Mine Another too, one. To be yeah. yeah. Right, dad. Good. Look at um, you guys with your parents happily married, like normal functioning people. <laughs> <laughs> Weirdos. <laughs> there goes, there goes uh, the score. Rocky scores. There you go. Nice, very nice, <clears throat> very nice to get the score on uh, the opposition's drive and uh, to have banged out half the team while doing so is um, great news for Unger. These are I the bangiest fucking humans ever. And the hilarious yeah, thing ridiculous. is the team isn't even bangy. Like the team yeah. isn't even bangy. He's got, he's got a pommer. A yep. tackle pommer, a tackle mighty, and a tackle mighty. Like it's the yep. it's and one dirty player. It's like my my necro is banging at my necro. My undead team is like undead nearly are much as bangier. Yep. Like it's it's yep. insane. It, it doesn't even have Crazy. the ogre. You know the ogre with mighty blow or something like mm -hmm. that. It's like uh, nothing. <laughs> well, I mean to be fair, he did this to like two lizard teams, right, and some and other teams. So uh, there was no hope that uh, armor eight was going to be able to hold up to it. Yeah. <laughs> yes, yeah. Artemis, yeah, all skill. All skill, baby. Mm -hmm. Yes, rolling the dice is a skill on itself. It's all on the wrist. It's it all is. on the wrist. Everybody That's knows it. that. I mean, it doesn't, it, you know, it, it chumps can't roll 10 pluses, like. It's true. And uh, and that's uh, that's where the real skill comes into playing uh, a, a good half of Blood Bowl. It's all well and good breaking the armor with the mighty blow, but you need to get the ten afterwards. To, you know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. This is the, this is. The, I mean, the, the most. To be a pro. Guys, yeah. Lord Run, I've seen <laughs> in a long, long time. I mean, uh, when uh, Rick won with uh, with his chores was also mm -hmm. a massacre, but it was a very bangy a charge team uh, at the beginning. Yeah, hundred percent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They were. You know, and it was charge. Yeah. Claw, mighty blow, violon, all that. Yeah. Okay, you make sense. This doesn't yeah. make any sense at all. Yeah. For sure. Yeah. Eri, you know, it's but blah, blah, these things happen, I suppose. You know, yeah, like a snarling can take down, can kill a tree. You know, mm. it's because you just need the, you just need to roll high enough. Yeah. You know, twice. <laughs> <laughs> Why did he take jugs? Because there's not much else Rubinho, like, he could have taken guard and had another guard, also, but if he's having jugs, every time, then just mm. take jugs. Yeah, having jugs is... jugs cancels wrestle. Yes. Yeah, fend. So, yeah, it, it stops the fend, which means you can fo follow up to make sure you get your pile on. It's uh, really useful if you uh, hit a, a, a guy with wrestle. You can use your block skill to knock them down anyway, because it ignores the wrestle skill. Um, and it also helps... Um, if you were to send him in somewhere and he rolls a one in nine, he can just take the push, shove a guy away, and not have to dodge away on a three plus. Yeah, it's a pretty good. It's a pretty good skill. It's just that it's, it's hard to take for most players because there's there's like other things like yeah, my but it's a, panning on block and tackle, which he already has. Correct. So as soon as he has all of those, jugs is normally the, the considered the best skill there. It's completely. Fine. Mm -hmm. Yes, also, when, usually when you get that, at that, that point, you are also going to face a lot of uh, teams with a lot of wrestling, so it's at the perfect spot. Yeah, for sure. Great against elves. I, I will say rats. That's a, that plays yeah, a rats rats rather well, yeah. killer. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, rats, rats particularly. Yeah. Gut mm. runners are, gut runners are absolute assholes, aren't they? <laughs> they really are. <laughs> yeah. You know they got the runner with the wrestle tackle strip ball. Come yeah. here, baby. <laughs> yeah. The Mars. Yeah, there's a few people that don't like the Marzale. I haven't had any problems with him personally, but um, there you go. I think he's played all the way. He's played pretty well all the way through Chalice. Yep. Um, apart from taking his finger off the pulse against the game in the game against Bright, um, but I think everybody kind of thought that game had been had been won by turn three. Um, <laughs> but uh, except Bright, that, that was that was an epic game to watch. Yeah, it was really fun, wasn't it? And fair play to Bright for keeping himself in it all the way. Mm. Oh, there you go. That's a perfect example there of... Uh, oh no, the, I thought that guy had uh, wrestled, but he didn't. He hasn't got anything now, he's off the pitch. <laughs> Indeed, yeah. So the Umans have got 10, and the Elves have got 6. Cripes. Not looking good for them, is it? It isn't, no. Uh, still has to pick up the ball, though. And he's picked up the ball. Uh, <laughs> so, yeah, this is pretty tricky. Yeah. I, I wish, I wish uh, Choublanc was uh, around here, you know, to give you, you know, the insights of the French mind versus the French mind. Oh, indeed. <laughs> yeah. Well, he, he's he got must be cast in it. He's got a leap, so he can just get the guard in and then leap in and 2D. And pretty easily, he's pretty easy 2D here. The the issue with uh, ha with how many guys you bring around the back is how many guys you leave in front, because they'll just reverse the field and then I don't stall. think La Marseillaise has, has a plan B. Yeah, I mean, yeah, for sure, what yeah. else can he do? Yeah, like, this is the yeah. Thing. He you can six, surrender first. Six players. You know, <laughs> so, he's not like he can, you know, screen. Mm. He's got to go in and hope for quads or something. Grab yeah, the sure. ball as quick as possible. Try to score. <laughs> Pray for the KO rolls. Hmm. Will he have to cut the assists up there? Well, no, because he can go to that square and then leap into there. Okay. Yeah, no, he does have to. He has to cut a lot of assists, doesn't he? Well, it's not looking good if you are uh, La Marseillaise. If you are Ungar, you are uh, living the good life. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I mean, it, it's horrendous for uh, for the Marseille. What can he do? Mm. It's not over. Okay, he needs to just put the guard there and leap and pray. Yeah. It's the I'm just I'm still trying to work out where the best uh, square to leap from is, um, because the when you land on the backside you're dodging off tackle as well, um, unless he dodges into the square into which he wants to make the hit. But if he does that, then uh, he's going to have to leap from an awkward angle, isn't he? Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight. So you could you can okay, move so that guy you, in there. So that's the thing, this yeah. This guy here. But that guy fierce gets. Uh, oh no, he's got sidestep. Yeah, so that's not a bad guy to go in there. Okay, something happened after uh, two minutes and a half. Yeah, which is fair play because this this is the turn for uh, La Marseillaise. There is a uh, nothing. Uh, ooh. Ooh. Right. Oh, he fell the leap. Um, it's not the square we uh, thought he'd go the, to either. He's going for the chunt uphill. It's the uphill, yeah. So with no strip ball, that's an easy push to take. Um, mm. Yeah. Uh, strange not to strange not to have brought in the guard to make it at least one. And that all guy doesn't that have assist. side step. Yeah, or so... cancel that assist, especially when he's bringing this guy all the way in anyway now. Yeah, not what I would have done. But who can um, hand, hand him in and, as well? Wow. Okay, so he just got the ordering all. Sorry, is is, is is he doing the turn in reverse? Yeah, it looks like it, doesn't it? <laughs> and he didn't do the dodge in. So yeah, the, no that's why I was curious about where the... No Because that was just where he should have dodged <laughs> in to make the leap, as, as Jim called it. But, um... Yeah. 
Okay, fair enough. <clears throat> so he's clogged it up a bit. But I don't think it's particularly hard to get out of this, is it? Tries a hard man to please, isn't he? <laughs> I mean, he's just doing some things, isn't he? He's, mm -hmm. he's, he's, up, he's up shit creek, isn't he? And it's just like, it's hard I to mean, do. at a mental level, you are just uh, destroyed. Turn nine, you look at your team, you have that, you are uh, 1,000 down, you're like, what the fuck is this? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, you, you are already spent, you know, all the... Pff you can write on chat, you know, your keyboard doesn't work. <laughs> yeah, he's all out of puffs. Is it no more puffs to give? <laughs> yeah, I of course try. I mean, but of yes, course, it's yeah. because it wasn't that difficult to make it uh, at least one D. You know, it's not like okay, let's go uh, crazy here. Yeah. yeah, I wouldn't. I wouldn't have hated making it one D and then try and punt with the other guy or something. But whatever, that was pretty terrible. I suppose he felt that the uh, the guard assist would have been the main recovery option, but like yeah. I mean, he still he had movement left on his blitz here, though, right? Yeah, but then at least just put in this guy and make it a one day yeah. that way, and then he's got the recovery in there. Yes. Uh, it wouldn't have been a one day though, uh, Jim, because of the guard, right? He he could have he could have done the four plus. Uh, done the four the yeah. four plus and then left to there, yeah, and then that would have meant that the other guy, yeah. So the the play as you called it, yeah, I definitely think yeah, that was yeah, the yeah, right put the guard uh, around is. Uh, yeah. I don't know. Is that something that the uh, Jim will wanna have to do because he's playing SFL in the American time zone? Mm. Exactly, yeah. So get, I'm not chanter there. Get to <laughs> fight the champ. Yeah. Spiro Metzo, the winner three five eight. I do get beaten by Gadenik though and Tom Schnees, yeah. so there you go. The uh that game against the winner three five eight went up on uh, YouTube already, did it not? It did, yeah. Yeah, super game, really fun. Yeah, it was pretty oh, fun. yeah. Really like the BMing in the second half it was just beautiful. What's this? Yeah. No piling on. Yeah. What a restraint. I don't believe oh, he, mm. Mm. Uh, he has the dirty player close. He has the dirty player close. Oh, okay. so it's, uh, <laughs> it's okay guys, it's okay. Yeah, well he need, he did need the second assist, right? And this way he can get two dice on that guy, <laughs> gets the pow because yes. Yeah, I think that, that John Doe in particular has been getting pows all day. Which has been really fun, like, you know, I mean, it happens, right? But How many, you know, it was uh, versus Blotch, it's got the power, I, mean, I think, maybe every single time? Yeah, I th it just certainly feels like that. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> I'd say for... Uh, block, blockless block with the wall yeah. of Blotch. Yeah, I'd say for Le Mercier, it certainly feels like that. Blotch is step guard, you know, that thing... <sighs> Oh, I mean, it's probably the right call. Jesus. <laughs> oh, my God. Say, I was going to say, if he's not yeah. a cast, that guy gets up, the other one leaps, and it's two dice. Yeah, yeah. But, well, I mean, it was the right square to, to go to, but uh, he was going to get fouled, and now he gets to put the foul in on the other guy instead. Oh, my God. Wow. One guy's That's a pretty, legend. pretty hilarious. Another like, cast. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah, not, not even caught, and wow. that's well. I mean, they're all dead elves now, right? Wow! And then <laughs> cheeky pow. This was on pow. was on uh, tackle at this guy at least, but it was a frenzy. Yeah, what two frenzy. into one, right? Yeah. Frenzy opportunity. And that, that uh, frees him up for this hit as well. It does, yeah. Wow! Yeah. Wow! <laughs> Greed in it, let's go. He wants he wants Wait, the he wants the pitch clear by turn twelve. <laughs> <laughs> He's going for that. Okay. He's, uh, wow. The book is run to the bookies, gentlemen, run to the bookies. <laughs> 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 Make your friends is coming. Yeah. <gasps> Good lord. Holy shit. I mean I, I love uh, high yield, but I have to admit this is one of the most spectacular dice I've uh, seen in a long time and probably mm -hmm. on a final. <laughs> yeah. Besides that final that uh, was over in turn three. Yes. Yeah, even Elliot might think this is over, yeah. Wow. Now we're saying stuff. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Okay, no. here, come, here comes another cast. I'll have to no. uh, find out more about these movies. Just, just give it a second. It's a dirty players to move all the three squares over to hit him first. <laughs> wow. 
This was like uh, sending yeah. the Smurfs versus Mordor. <laughs> <laughs> That's quite good. I like that. It's fun. The funny thing is, try that if he skipped turns, he wouldn't mm -hmm. get banned for three seasons. Hmm. But if he conceded, he would. Hmm. And like, it's not affecting anyone because it's the final. And it's not mm -hmm. a spectator sport or anything, is it? Like, okay, I'm casting it. Art's probably casting it. And like you know, maybe some other people are, but like it, it's not. There's no money in it. There's nothing. There's absolutely no reason to care oh, about real. the final <gasps> ball. And and there's also there's no better. It's not better to skip turns than it is to concede anyway. So, hmm. It's absolutely stupid that he would get banned. I, I can't believe yeah. the first guy did it got banned. To be honest. Yeah, when it was uh, when it happened, it was like I mean, it's like. Uh... In any other stage of the tournament, yes. Yeah, but mm -hmm. uh, here it's like, hmm. Yeah, exactly. Because you know you can be screwing someone else over in the tournament if you concede. So that's to that's totally reasonable. If it's like the semi, you know, because if you play out, you might cast somebody or whatever, <laughs> or like you know, stopping leveling people, things like that. Money, you know, yeah, there's all sure, sorts yeah. of things yeah. that. But like in the final, who gives a fuck? Well, I, I, I mean, it is a spectacle sport, though, right? But there's a bunch of us here watching it on purpose because it's the final and it's I mean, the... we are, but it, it doesn't matter, does it? Like, it doesn't matter yes. that we are. Uh, I mean, if there is 181 <laughs> people here, you ask, ah, even Trific will say that, yeah, yeah, let the man get, get a break. Yeah, yeah, Trific. even, even try. <laughs> Oh wow! He's, I mean, there's all of the uh, oh, the double skulls. -ish. Good <laughs> God, man! He's got him! He's got him! He's got him! Reroll works. Oh, sorry. The, the screen froze on the double skull, oh, so <laughs> I'm like, oh, cool. Okay, you got him. Yeah, exactly, Doctor Dog. It's over. It's actually over. Hello, hello. Uh. Oh, he could get the ball and pass it to this guy. Amazingly, why amazingly, he... Ungern has left a guy untagged who can just. Why, why did he wrestle him instead of taking the block? Because it was a red dice. Uh, yeah, nobody took the skull, but you're, he has both block and wrestle. No, he's just got wrestle. It's all oh, it's the different guy. I'm really sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah that guy got cast. <laughs> yes, of course. Yeah. That <laughs> guy left the pitch. That guy got minus yes. strength. He, Don't he worry did. about him. <laughs> Here comes the pass play. You only need two elves to win a game. You oh, only no. need two elves to win a game. Uh. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Oh, he's not even throwing it to that guy. He's just throwing it beyond him. Uh, That's not the... That's not terrible. I think it would be That's... better with him because he might not foul him. And now... Well, exactly. exactly. Yeah. He could have thrown it to the actual bludger. I think would have been fine. Well, he's not that far away anyway, you know. Like... Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Weird. <laughs> well, let's not forget the fact that it's uh, probably being uh, streamed on one of the French channels to a large proportion of uh, their player base as well. Yep. Just, you know, the devil's advocate. Yep. Ha ha ha. Wee wee wee. Plim plum plu. Yes, they need to make quotes from mm -hmm. the movie Moline Rouge. <laughs> yep. Which was in front of the hotel when I stayed in Paris, and it was before the Moulin Rouge became cool again and fancy. When it was the Moulin Rouge, was a fucking horrible place. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, yeah. There's a few people streaming it, and like you know, it's like it's cool. Like obviously, it's cool to watch and that, but you know, come on, it doesn't matter if somebody like banning someone for three seasons is literally insane. I couldn't it's... believe it when it happened. I couldn't. Believe if you, uh, again, if you ask everybody, you know, the channels and all that. The... I mean, uh, most of the people will say, it's all right. Yeah. Fair enough. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it depends on the game as well, right? This uh, does seem like a bit of a foregone conclusion, but um, no. Uh, they, still, th he still got the ball down. He still did the throw, you know? Yeah. Mm. They did oh. guess it, the English fans. Yeah. The Spanish fans didn't have any problem at all. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. At all. Surprising. So, I mean, this. Six dice coming in here with uh, tackle should be able to sort this fella out. Uh, not hitting with mighty blow, but going for the six dice instead. Yeah, it's pretty safe, right? <laughs> Obviously, an armor break from the catcher. 
<laughs> Absolute pinnacle. That's fair enough. Yeah, <laughs> that's fair enough. No one was going to concede this oh, final. That's true. The jokes. Mm. Yeah, the jokes. The memes will be endless. Is uh, uh, La Marseillaise uh, surrenders now. I mean, some of it wasn't deserved, though. But yeah, I mean, in general, English fans abroad are pretty bad. <laughs> It's the same with happening with the final in uh, Seville of the Europa League. Mm -hmm. You know, the Scottish uh, fans said there was no water, blah, blah, lots of problems, like that. The Spanish fan side, no comments at all, no problems at all. Oh my God, Dr. Fields, but that is brilliant. If you want to experience what it's like to try and see through tear gas, Blood Bowl 3 is... <laughs> well, hey! <laughs> all comes together, all comes together. Amazing. Yeah, English abroad in general, that's true. Yeah, not just football fans, just English English people abroad tend to yeah. tend to drink a lot and be rowdy idiots. And, <laughs> and let's not forget that the French stadium is in a area with a lot of immigration, mm -hmm. black, African and uh, Muslim immigration. So adding 20,000 uh, uh, British English fans to the mix, I can imagine, drunk, most of them, I can imagine some words were thrown around. Mm. Yeah. English football uh, was uh, banned from Ireland for uh, about 15 years, in fact. Uh, there was only a game two years ago, I believe, was the first time since the 90s that they've been allowed back over. After a, a rather fiery incident in uh, Lansdowne Road. English people are twats in England. That's true, Matt. Oh, yeah. English yes, 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 yes. Yeah, it's not just true, abroad. Yes. <laughs> to be they, fair, they, it's not limited to abroad. They, they even have a political party. It's 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 just more it's just more apparent when when you have the culture clash. Then isn't it when you've got like a city full of normal people and there's twenty thousand lunatics. Mm. <laughs> I mean, why you, Mars? Why are you telling that there were a few Spanish fans at the Europa final? It was in Spain. He was played in Seville, you know, and there was also the, the other uh, team uh, supporters, you know, the, <laughs> that didn't complain, you know. <laughs> so, yeah, it's, it's, it's interesting that always, you know, the bad luck goes to the same uh, group of fans. There's a handoff. Nah, he's just gonna, he's just gonna have him in the, in the cage. Uh, oh, okay, so it's Vengabussing. Yeah, Vengabussing. So a little bit of sensibleness from mm. Though neglecting to put guard on the back. Yeah, no guard on the back, yeah, because he, he wants, wants to use his it's Marty Blair. <laughs> yeah, Marty Blair tackle, right? He could fill in the back with an extra player, which would, which would work. Mm -hmm. He's not going to, though, because there were three players, and one's the assist, I mean, one's the go, flick, yeah. and one's the foul. One's so the I knew foul, he was yeah. going to fill it in. Exactly, yeah. <laughs> Well, you can always take this here. Well, yeah. So I can fill it in. You can always, you can stay here and follow in. Yeah, you can go in and fill in the gap or come back for the assist. Come back for the <laughs> assist. Come back for the assist. Course, yeah. We know what That's he's really doing. It's really funny. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yeah. He was, uh, there is no surprises yeah. anymore here. <laughs> I suppose it's it's pretty well played because if you didn't get the KO as well and the guy wasn't broken armor, he was the the tackle was on him to stop him from going back up the pitch. And uh, here yeah. comes the last. Uh, yeah, so second drive. broke on. So pretty nice, uh, pretty nice. Um, Square is found as well. So yeah, no arguments. Well, this is pretty easy, right? Two, three, yes. two to through there. Then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. GFI gets the one D and impals him. Then he runs through, picks it up. Dodges mm -hmm. away, lobs it over there, he still loses. Mm-hmm. Is he gonna go for the uphill? Yeah, it looks like it. Hello HTK, mm. that sounds a bit sus. Doesn't get the dodge in. No. Okay. Three ones in a row. Yeah, that's not gonna help, eh? <laughs> I have been sniffing glue. <laughs> It's funny that this, that this Vengabus was worse than just a normal X cage, right? If he just X cage, he could have just X cage with guard on the corners. But yes. Instead, did a did a Vengabus that was literally worse. By rolling by rolling nines and tens mostly, our Yeti. <laughs> well, eights, nines, and tens. Hell of a player. Hell of a player's ungern. 
Uh, I mean, he's played all right, hasn't he? He's, he's, he hasn't done anything wrong, really. It, he has. Game. He's. I mean, there's been a. It's very banger orientated, but it's working really well. So I have no reason to give out about it uh, or say anything. And even like as I said in that last turn where he came back to get the assist, it was technically the right squares for it to stop that guy from getting back into the game. So in the semi-final, he had a very rough first half. Mm -hmm. And he was able to compose himself to annihilate the other team in the second half. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah. Oh my god, what is this dicing? <laughs> no pitch clear though, so... No pitch clear. No. Sad. Yeah. Yeah, Disgraceful. Fair Sag. Worst final ever. <laughs> Worthless title, not like a, <laughs> like when I won it passes on a playing as a Sniperino on 8000. <laughs> it was nice of you to retire at the top as well and give the other guys a chance, Femir, by the way. Uh, yeah, of course, I mean, I, I just wanted to prove a point. Yeah, good man. <laughs> I can win the cup as a player and a coach. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Every, everyone's everyone's a great Lamar against Lamar. It's pretty funny. Oh dear. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, um, so he's got that, and then he comes in the bottom way so that he can't sidestep in. Cool. That wasn't what I expected. But. Yeah, no, that wasn't what I was expecting either. I was—I thought he was going to do it to the... Uh, With the uh, frenzy, yeah. Three and two, that's fine. Uh, yeah, exactly, yeah. funny shapes oh. in the beach. You don't get it. <laughs> Just throw an old, another old uh, one day, or one no assist foul. Yeah. Tell you what, Ungern certainly got value from his bribes, <laughs> didn't he? He's fouled like nearly every single turn. Oh, in hell! Yeah. He gets sent off finally gets sent on 15. I mean, like, that dirty player has been, like, player of the entire tournament so far, right? Yeah. Yep. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah. It's more than the Pumber, because the Pumber, at least, you know, like, okay, I think a dirty player, oof, working yeah. hard, working the legs. <laughs> that guy never skipped leg day. <laughs> I mean, people were going for him as well. Like, there was a lot of effort put into removing that dirty player, and he was like, nah, boy, I'm grand. Just <laughs> give me a second. Give me a second, coach. I'll go kick that fill in the head. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've done that, Wolf Bar. Now, uh, now Lemar says every single time someone plays <laughs> against him. Yeah. They will start the chat with. So the yeah. final, mate. What a game. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's a fair point, Steve. Uh, they just didn't want to qualify, though. Yeah, did not want to qualify to do that team. Got a worst match ever. It was really fun, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But if your natural one turner never scores a one turner, so yeah, there is a that's a bad sign. <laughs> Indeed. Yeah. He just needs to punch this guy, doesn't he? Yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, and you can 3 die him pretty easily. Gets him. Boom. There we go. Gets him off the ball as well. And uh, yes, because nice old piling you know, on. That, that was the danger for Anger there, you know, losing yeah. the ball right now. The mm -hmm. game on the edge. It is really... Uh, with the shift. This is it. I mean, you know, uh, another stall there and... Uh, yeah, no, there's not. Holy you know what would be amazing? Just putting the guy one square away from the touchdown mm -hmm. and just press and turn. Yeah, yeah, there's no mm. need to score. There's mm. no need to score. Because mm. you could score and then they could get a riot one turn and then a blitz. Yeah, for sure. Equalize. Like, not really, you know, with how many players, but yeah, the, the best players to just end the turn. It's to yes, just end turn, just yeah. Put the guy there, say, oh, to yeah. uh, les amis. Does he uh, have a guy who could uh, level or anything? 
Oh, well, there is a that's a oh, the, the no, thrower could have if he wanted to. Doesn't care about open or does he? He can foul or he can get the pitch clear. He can get the turn sixteen pitch clear now. Cool, cool. Ah, James, it's got an pretty toxic. No, toxic part. Yeah. That's the top two part, the scoring! Oh, he is scoring! He is scoring! Oh, the man, man. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I, I don't know the inner politics of the French community, but maybe Anger and La Marseillaise have something uh, uh, between them. <laughs> oh, <dear. laughs> oh, I'd like to think that they were uh, having a nice little chat as they played the game. And, yeah. uh, do you know, it's bubble. These things happen, right? Yes, uh, yes, these things happen. One team, yes. one team gets just banged on. It's just impressive that it, you know, went on for an entire chalice this time. <laughs> yeah. yeah, but there is, there is a background, you know, be, behind every game, every community, so we don't know. Hmm. Maybe they are best pals and they're laughing about this, or maybe, you know, Ungar is <laughs> deep down. Yeah, of course, I'm going to foul. <laughs> So, so has well, to put his three guys on the line. Three and, players for uh, yeah. Le Marseille. Yes, if he had, uh, he was playing against the uh, the, the artificial intelligence of the uh, Blue Ball Two. <laughs> he had a guaranteed win. But yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this isn't looking good. Now nah, they're probably just uh, exchanging pleasantries. And uh, mm -hmm. GG, no GG, no no GG. No, no, no. Yeah. Oh my god! Oh, no, Rocky! Oh, it's just a badly harsh man. Can you imagine if he didn't score, then that, or you had scored, then that guy got killed for no reason? Yeah, it'd be funny. Yeah. Because he actually set up to stop this one turn as well. I don't think this is, this is it. They're going to just uh, chat and present that yesterday. Yeah. Yeah. Well, 19 AV breaks, nearly up to his usual standard of 20. <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> Just absolute, absolute classic from Ungern. Um, he really knows how to go for the kills, doesn't he? Six mm. KOs and six Kaz from 19 AV breaks. Unbelievable. Yes, he went for the kill since the first day this team was created. Yeah. And, yep. <laughs> It's not even a bashy human team. Like it's just unbelievable. What a what an unbelievable dice runs. There you go. Yes, you just need to roll the dice you need whenever you need them. You know, don't waste good rolls in stupid stuff. Yeah, yeah. Absolutely. He played well in the moments that he needed to. He got himself a nice team all the way to Chalice, and he played. He played. He played some nice blood ball as he as he went along. He did bang plenty of guys out. Nobody's going to deny that. Uh, mm. But uh, he did play some nice blood ball, ball, ball. So congratulations to him. Yeah. Yeah, congratulations and commiserations to the Marseille. Thank you very yes. much for having me here on Kalon. Absolutely glorious as always. Pleasure. What a final has been. What a final has been. We'll be forever remember. <laughs> <laughs> and thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.